What's going on, everybody? And welcome back to The Walking Dead Season 2. So, we're now uploading for uh, about a week, I think it's been. I had, honestly haven't had time this time, alright? I've been at work a lot. I already had to work eight hour shifts all last week. So, I really haven't had time. I had to come home at like 12, 12 in the morning by that time I was really beat. So, apologize for not uploading. Uh, today, I think for the next few days, I'll get time. Maybe just today, I'll get time. I don't know. So, like I said, my schedule is going to be for uploading videos. It's going to be a little different now. But, uh, yes. Yeah, so, Anyway, we're following back with The Walking Dead Season 2. I'm sorry it took so long. Let's jump right back into it. And I tried to actually record a while ago, and but I wasn't really feeling like playing The Walking Dead Season 2. And, uh, well, it didn't go so well. And I am still in need of, an, of a USB, apparently. Because the USB I thought I had, or I thought that was good, wasn't. So yeah, again, sorry it's been a week. I think we ended Stanley Parable. Stanley Par Parable Ultra Deluxe, and uh, here we are. Back with Season 2. I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. I just hope it saves everything because I honestly don't remember too much of what happened last season, the last episode. I know I think we. Yeah, I know it showed it didn't. I know it showed it didn't. Uh, we didn't so, help Krista. I know it showed that, but maybe. Pretty much on your this own. That's one different thing. What's your plan? Maybe I could stay here for a little bit, if that's all right. I've got no problem. I really don't remember if I said that. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. I remember Think saving your Carver. What do you do? P, not David. I was about Carver? to call him David for some reason. You were in the woods. I'm pretty sure I saved P. I don't think I gave this guy the water. No, I didn't. I'm fine. Okay. I'm fine. Show him. Just, just lost my phone. As long as he goes with P, I'm fine. God damn it! Come this way. Damn it, right. over here. I know I went with Pete. That's the big thing. I don't think this will change. At least I hope not. Right? I didn't go with Pete. Yep, I went with Pete. Good, 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 good. I, I meant to see, see that. There we go. So we're like recording again because it's been so long. I'm pretty sure I went with Pete. So. Oh my god, it really has. How long? Is, yeah, I don't even remember how long it's been since the last played this. I really should have checked. But I've been busy playing Borderlands 2 all day because I finally got uh, got uh, Borderlands Handsome Collection, God of War officially, and Days Gone today. So got three games in one for a really cheap price. It's nice, right? So here we go. Zelda Games presents in association with Skybound Entertainment. I really gotta remember how to why I did this. The Walking Dead. On the downside, we can't get through. Well, if it's locked on this side, I think we'll be okay. Well, can we drive the truck at least? Oh, this is really weird. I have not played this in a long time, so my memory's generally kind of forgotten all that. I haven't, I haven't, like I said, I haven't played uh, any Walking Dead in a very long time. Ah, uh, you got bitten. I hate it. Polite. How are you Come feeling? On, Nothing. What are you gonna do? What are you going to do? Gonna cut it off like Lee did? No, I didn't do that in this version, did I? Hand me that there. I kept it, I think. Okay. Just give the saw. Bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Uh. Just. Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. Oh boy. There's a lot. Yeah, of good luck with that. I'll try to find something to help. Anything that can. Yeah. I think we saved my water bottle. I'm pretty sure we saved my water. I think I was a, from last episode. I don't fully remember though. Wait, it says it's in my inventory. Ah, <coughs> oh, whatever. I'll take Anything it. Anything in that? <coughs> it's 
There should be. Save it or give it to Pete. Not much. <laughs> Here. Give it to him, he's dying. Thanks. Okay. Yeah, I remember not giving him the guy the water, I think. I'll keep looking around. I don't think anything happens if I actually do save the water. I think he just doesn't get water. i watch. No, I want to keep that for Nick later in this episode. What's that? Oh, that's the hacksaw. What's in there? Anything we can use? Give me one. It's, uh... Probably take cigarettes. Tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. Yeah, just give him a cigarette. You got a light? Yeah, I really gotta get back in the mood of this game and how depressing it is. Well, I said I haven't. That tastes about. Like I said, the only games I, I think I've been playing this now today are not depressing games, just like we wait. More action oriented, I guess. I've been playing like Star War. I've been just been playing Borderlands to, today. So co co comedy. So I was a bit more familiar in comedy, comedy and action, and do, uh, playing a lot of yeah, Borderlands, Doom, and Star Wars. Trying to re 100 percent it again. And I need to get back on that because I need to get to episode 6 uh, for y'all. need to get to episode 6. And I'm going to do it on PS5. And get a better uh, USB. As in, I probably should just buy one from Amazon, but I'm too damn lazy. Oh, God. Are you alive? Don't be dead, Pete. Poke him. Just poke him. Oh boy. Oh god. There we go. This is the kind of thing I was not uh, ready for today. At the site, we're an image. Jesus, stuck in this. Again, the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? I've been thinking. What? And yes, please. Die. Comedy could help. <laughs> it's not funny. I did not laugh. I not never funny. I thought I'd be the kind did of idiot to laugh. say something like that. But there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. What does it feel like? Uh, it feels like... Like a rope was wrapped around my neck. I'm getting tighter every second. It feels like I can't... <coughs> can't breathe. Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I love that stupid I'll watch kid. out for him, even though no I'm, what I'm a 11 year old kid. He is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Thanks. He is kind of an idiot, though. And he gets no role after this episode. They ain't gonna find us. That's one thing about this this game. It's like, Where like I said, this is probably like Telltale's second best Walking Dead game. Uh, but yeah, this is definitely, in my humble opinion, where oh, kind of the series starts to go down a little bit. It's heavily flawed. Gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you Where some Nick time. has absolutely no role in it. And choices really don't mean a damn Thank thing in this you. game. You go find my nephew. Like now, I, right? there's no choice that actually is important. I know like every Telltale game you can say, oh none son. of them really do. But there's <laughs> some like something does change around the world. Just some change choices do actually right. affect them and Small or big ways, but there is a change in the scenery in the way it's being played here. Not really. It don't, there is absolutely none of that feeling in this one. Let's get this over with. Because it's not like oh, something oh so it's here. It's like oh something oh so slightly different happens. In season one, it was like yes, there, you know, like Carly and uh, uh, 
Doug both die regardless, but different scenarios happen with them. Ha happen with them, like Carly one for instance. You can actually reveal to certain people. Uh, so reveal that you were a murderer to Kenny, uh, optionally, and that could affect if he wants to come with you by the end of the game. So, yes, they still die, but there's other choices that came out of that one choice that could affect another thing at the very end of the game and, and your overall relationship with certain characters. So, episode two, house divided. Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? I don't know! Hours. Where are they? I swear I have this part- What? What happened? Walker's I swear this part of the game, there was like, something got cut. God. I swear, something here in this scene got cut. Where like, we were supposed exactly. to see Al Alvin and Luke, like, find us, but it got cut. It seems like that. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Like, just something like that. Like, I know we're Clementine. told that, but still, it just seems kind of... Can you I mean, it makes out. sense, but... She's upstairs. Just It just kind of, like, comes out of nowhere at the same time. Like, it makes anything. sense, but... I'll take care of her. Yeah, you can trust me. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Oh, this choice you makes nothing. The there is no consequences anything. with we'll this at all. That's the and thing about this game. Thank you. Season one, uh, season two has... a. I would like all Telltale games I played. This is the, the one that has the choices mean don't mean one little thing. It's not like something ever so slightly changes. Your relationship changes. Say cheese. This is the one like literally none of them matter. I found Other than the place. very ending, the very last choice stuff. means something. That's where it means something. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? So. What's wrong? I don't hate. I I, um, I don't hate the that? game, but it's very obvious with this this season. You should know what's going on. He told you not to tell me. Although, in my opinion, um. He is in trouble. I think from this oh season and onward, or at the very end of season what one, is where. Clem? Choices really start aff affecting the game. What's going on? Everyone's gone. It's bad. I don't, I don't like that. I said this about a remake, and also apparently, um, I, I just the, la the last re of us remake, um. I said like, oh, it looks like it might be just a cash grab, and there was it was just a graphical. Um, enhancement. I was sort of right. I was sort of right about that. The reason I'm bringing that up is because the whole like rumor popped up about no gameplay enhancements, and then immediately came out with like gameplay enhancement video. Which I don't think anything is going to change. Trust me. They're going to say it changed, but I don't think really anything's going to change. But it's not a toy. Kind of like uh, the Last of Us Two. It's going to be more similar to the Last of Us Two, but there's really no difference. What does that mean? Um, As it, it's gonna play the exact same, I just more like the second okay. game. And I'm calling it now. The game is just gonna be the rewritten to justify the sequel. Right? That's the entire point. It's called Part One now, not a remake or all that. It's oh, okay. Part One. So there, so it's just. What should I shoot? Something's gonna happen with it, and I'm not ex even expecting. Sorry. I'm not Sorry. paying seventy bucks for it. Maybe I could for it because I'm just not expecting it There's that tree. to be all that grand. It's like the original I game, but it's like, that. I have the remaster. I'm happy with the remaster. I, I, I just sense it. And I was sort of right. That's not good. I didn't want to be right about that game. It's just gonna just, just the ending's gonna change. That's the only thing that's gonna happen. The ending will change and justify everything good. that happens in the sequel. It's gonna justify um, it. I think I know him. And people are going in certain people who like the sequel see? are gonna be like, oh, that's so great, great scene. Now you're it was fun. It was what? like now it's fun. Where 
Or really, it's just uh, they had to make, make remake the entire game and add a scene in to justify later, to, to justify sequel events. Hello. You know, it's kind of like if Disney went back and uh, with Star Wars and added some like added hints of Ray <laughs> in the original trilogy. Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. To justify justify it. That's right. You know, it wouldn't really My make any sense. I set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George. I, mean. I can just sense the. I'm not looking forward Pleasure to anything Last of Us anymore. I'm just not looking forward to it anymore. You mind if I anything Last of Us? I'm just not excited excited for it. The show, I'm not excited for. I know it's not gonna be good. Yes, I do mind. I'm just not expecting that to be good. I'm not expecting everything from the last episode. I'm like, the first game was great. It's that's all I, I, I like. The sequel it's was awful. You don't usually see oh my god! It just hit me. It's Life is Strange. Have a big group. It's just Lots. like Life is Strange, oh. except the first game I like That's ironically best. now. It's soon. still a bad game, and but I like it art. But I like it ironically now. I must trust you. But everything else after well, it was awful. I'm out looking for my people. And I mean actually bad. Seven of them to be exact. They've been gone a long while and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet Maybe. Girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. The only really good villain in the Walking Dead games. None of them became like good as Negan, but Carver's like the only one who was actually decent. Cause he generally felt like a threat. Everyone else felt like a carbon copy of him. Well, like, like Joan ran completely here. out of the fuck. Must be like Yeah, that's still uh, even though I actually am one of the few people who liked More. a new frontier. Mm. Yeah, it's still Joan is still He's a terrible villain. And Lily too. Granted, she was going to become a villain in the original no, season one. Nuts, Granted. Looking for Shangri-La. Where do you live? Yeah, down by the river there. But um. A little spot with a boat where we pitched. She feels like way too far in. Everything else. To her. Like I you said, will, I, I talked about it before. I'm not repeating myself. What kind of tents? Big orange ones. Why? Just wondering. Where does this go? A lot of the over there. In the drawer there. I don't know, it, just, it doesn't feel like any villain past this game has this, this like, presence of, oh fuck, oh fuck, I don't want to fuck with this guy. Like I do with Carver. Carver, I actually generally fear. It's a real nice place. Joan and Lily, not really. Like, like Joe and I really never felt anything. My God, they give you an option to shoot her. I was more pissed I off. Always wore shirts like this, but not, not threatening. Great. She felt more like a nuisance. Real smug son of a bitch. I know that's kind of the same with him, but Real you know, you know what I mean. I miss him. What happened I to him? I don't care. Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. Well, well. I mean, don't get me wrong, he's probably like second. Three moves away from checkmate. Is he second best in the entire Walking Dead series? That? I'm trying to think. Like between. Yeah, it's probably second in the entire Walking Dead series. It, it was between book or movie, uh, book, show, or com, uh, game. Here. He's probably second best villain, Negan being the top I'm villain from the anything. comic. Maybe because he has, he has a redemption arc, but you can also see his point of view. That's always also what lights about like Negan's character is you see his point of view. I could always actually understand it. Like, he was an asshole. He was doing shit completely wrong, but I see what he was saying. No one really won that fight. Like, no one, like, yeah, Negan's wrong, but he's doing it for right reasonings and... I what I loved about here. the comics, Seems which I have not read. I need to reread the comics. It's been so freaking long since I've done it. I haven't even collected the deluxe edition in a while. Good conscience, if someone was poking around, right? Shh. 
sure. I really wish, because I thought about this in Season 3, that Negan was going to come in, in in Season 3. And I really wish that had, did happen. I wish more combo book characters were in these games. Like, only two of them have it. And only oh, one of them has a huge... Um... Impression. Must be someone who lived here. Must be. I have a huge impression with it. Like, it's season three only that has a huge comic. No like idea. one big char character for the comics that influences that game. Do you know them? Let me ask you this: When you met them, how much did they trust you? Well, they locked me up in a shed. If people don't trust you. How can you trust them? See, he even has good points. He's not like a cliche villain like Lily I think became. I've troubled you long enough. She was. I let myself out. Please, can't convince me she wasn't cliche as Why fuck. Why shouldn't I trust them? You have a real good day now. Just saying. She was kind of a comical villain. The final season isn't as good as everybody says it is. I don't know, I'm very critical of that final game because it's He's gone. not as good as everyone says it is. I think so many people were just uh, psyched up about playing Clementine again. They just completely blocked all the flaws the game actually had. I can, I'm convinced of that because they were pissed off in Season 3. Season 3 is no, not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but it's nowhere as awful. People say it's like, oh, it's awful. It's one of the worst. Everyone hated it. Clementine. They hated it because Clementine Sarah. wasn't playable. They told me about Pete. Okay, granted, it's you not the higher is. reasoning, but I'm pretty sure there's the main reason. One of the main here. reasonings. What? What did she say? Which I understand, but someone came to the cabin. What? They didn't. Clementine talked to him, and you just opened the door no, for no. him. Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Although, granted, I do name? agree. That did he it could have been handled differently. Was. That season three choices Maybe really shouldn't have been affected in New Frontier. He said his name was George. George? That's what he said. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Like, that's where I do agree. Did like, he sound different? Yeah, see how everything how went in season he? three. His voice was gravelly. Like how? Uh, d know. definitely didn't kind work. Deep and scratchy. He talked about you, Dad. Like, You're not gonna it, because it was more of a spinoff than it was of for a third was, season. Sarah. Your dad's the nicest man. No, I it know, feels which like is why he's not going to do anything. It's spin off more than a sequel. Not nice, right? It's like you know, um, some bad people, sweetie. They will do or say. Uh, part five of Friday the uh thirteenth. It's how it feels like a new bad? beginning. It's how it is actually. It's a lot like it where um, Jason isn't the killer. Picture? It's some random new guy. Carlos, Movies, no, I mean, no, not really that good. But alright, you're scaring your daughter. I took the picture. It's my fault. No, I asked you uh, to. But, it's my fault. Yeah, Jason wasn't the killer in that one. It was someone else. It was an EMZ guy, and yeah, it was kind of stupid, but... He was scouting. He wasn't the main Unlucky. guy, and people he were pissed off that it wasn't Jason. That's how it feels like with the new Frontier. It's like, people were pissed off you couldn't play Clementine. But I don't believe the game was ever advertised as the third season. And maybe it should well, have been... Around, like, been a part be of the story, the but gave... We don't have but much kept time. Kenny and Jane alive. I do think killing them off was a mistake. We're moving out. Unless Alvin, determined by your decisions. We have to leave now, sweetie. Before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what like, he I think there should have been a way how William Kenny Carver could have lived and died. And just, depending, depending on your choices in season three, they could have lived or died. Here, and he's very smart. I don't know, Lucky something like that. Escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. Like, you, you personally to get to decide if they live and die, if you get to see, see him in it in season three. We have to in the first Pete. episode. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Like, depending Long on your time. decisions. You know where he was, So right? kind of keep season three yeah. the same, but right. you are directly responsible stuff, for the death, the possible death of them. Just to, keep, just, just to tweak it a little bit more. You said it was just up here? Listen, like I said, I didn't say yeah, season three was perfect. A ways. There's clear issues with it, but it's not the worst Sorry thing ever. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. I still don't like what you did. Sneaking around on us and taking advantage of my husband. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us. It's a long story. He... 
And I don't want to come off as a hypocrite because I say that shit about the New Frontier, but I, I go and talk to you all the time about The Last of Us 2. You know, Granted, they both have similar issues. Sometimes it's hard but just how dependent I am on it. they admitted that they, it's I'm about a different bad. character. They just didn't me. admit it was the third season. That's where they fucked up. So it's all fucked up. They believe Alvin and I still don't they... Or him, if that man I, I, what, what was like the advertising for season Any sequel ideas? of the second game of Clem? Last of Us? Um, I think they were hinting that oh Ellie and that they weren't portraying as Abby as the main character. I think they were trying to make Ellie the main character and hiding it that Abby really was the main character in that game. There, that's where in Thursdays they admitted, hey, Javi's the main character here. They admit, hey, it's Javi's story. Don't. Like, they admitted it, so... He's not they didn't try to hide it, they this didn't the last try to... They also didn't try to Maybe force Javi into Season 2 or 1. They didn't try to interconnect him. It was like, no, this is just a part of a... Like, they have to meet. This is the first time meeting. This is a completely separate time... And stay time in... Time in... Uh, time in The Walking Dead. So, it's just completely different. It's, just, it's connected, but loosely connected. Kind of thing. Which I like. It's like, okay, you're not forcing them into the sequel this is their game and their game only so i i can accept it if that was how abby was going to be introduced maybe it would have worked maybe still gotta make her a likable character anyone see him or not make her but yeah no if but i still would have been pissed off if like Javi killed Clementine in the first 10 minutes of season 3 we are forced to play Javier in the rest of season 3 I would have been pissed off and said oh fuck season God. 3 because that wouldn't have worked and been bullshit what happened? granted what the hell happened? they had a choice like that to fuck her over but it was pretty justifiable and, and actually a hard decision to make who did this? son of a bitch we need to go He's gone, Nick. He, he, he's gone. You gotta get moving. Come on, man. Uh, and just because that season three fucked up doesn't mean this game didn't f up either. I don't think Luke like happened. Luke, for instance. Shouldn't have died like at all. Well, that was that was Pete. I feel like he sorry. he went out way too damn soon. He should have lived. Like one character should live from every season. I know that was AJ in this game, but AJ and Luke should have been the ones who survived. Kind of like he, he survives no matter what. I'm worried about that kid. I think like regardless of what no, you do, me, Luke you survives. You season three is where that decision becomes us. questionable. Look. I know he might die in season cool three, but stuff. he's. And I can't make any promises; it won't get rougher. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And but uh, glad to have you. Not everyone is. For the most part, well, you can have Luke with, get there. with you, or have an option to have Luke guys in season days three or not. Just now, to make it more interesting us, and more. We should be able to lose up there. Five days? Maybe that's just that's just how my Let's brain's trying to think of things. We have to keep moving now. Uh, because in my mind that makes more sense if um. For like Luke to survive, no matter what, like no matter which path you go down, you will be with Luke in every single ending. Like Luke will always be in in the season. Like with the Jane ending, the lone ending, Kenny ending, Wellington. Luke will be with you. Except maybe Wellington, and that might be the only exception. But I think it, I think it, you could make it work, regardless. I really do think you can make it work. And Luke may be with you in season three to, if you're See alone. Anything? Like he could honestly, the only way Luke could Sorry, die is if you're on the alone ending, for it. and that's it. A if you get the alone the ending, that's the only time Luke could like possibly it. die. Big. Every 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 other time, Luke is it with you like and he survives in season three. Night. Then sometime in season three, Kenny, yeah, Jane could possibly a... die in that season. Something. Then it, it, just to, like I said, season three could use improvements, but not. I'm just not pissed. It wasn't pretty. I don't know. Maybe that my opinion will change when we There's get there. The I played a passable? third season in a w little while, so my opinions may change. Good. There's a little. That's how I, I kind of see it. How big is it? 
It's pretty small. We have to cross that bridge. Let's Alrighty, and with that, we are done with this episode of The Walking Dead Season 2. Yeah, sorry about the rambling there for a minute. I'm just trying to think of things to talk about because I haven't really recorded in a while. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys tomorrow. Hopefully see you guys tomorrow. I can't promise that. Um, like I said, I got work now, and I'm leaving at 12 tomorrow. So for the next three days, um, I'll be off. I can guarantee a video on f Monday. Possibly Monday there will be a video. 100% on Monday. Very confident on the Monday day. Yeah, that, that works on Monday. So Monday you'll definitely get a video, right? Yeah, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I'm off on Monday. So there will be a video on Monday. Either Monday or Tuesday. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. See you guys tomorrow with um, uh, the rest of episode two. Hopefully tomorrow.